published 1732 EDT, 14 October 2017 Updated 1821 EDT, 14 October 2017 Everton manager Ronald Koeman isn't going soft on his players despite the club's alarming start to the season leaving them short of confidence. Komen is in the firing line before today's game at Brighton following a run of one Premier League win in six that has seen them slip towards to the relegation places, a massive disappointment after a pound's £150 million summer spend. But midfielder Tom Davies, who got away from club troubles, to score the winner for England UNDER 21s against Andorra on Tuesday has revealed the famously straight-looking Dutchman hasn't allowed his approach to change. Tom Davies' centre praised Ronald Koeman's Everton training sessions as what the team need who haven't been doing the best lately, but in training it's always high tempo, and your touch has got to be perfect, said the local Liverpudlian who grew up two minutes drive from the club's old training ground in the north of the city. Even when we're not playing well has not going to let us off with giving the ball away. The standards are the same. If you don't live up to them, you are going to hear about it. You know Hess going to say that you need to be better. You could say Hess tough and demanding, but as a manager that's what you need. It's good for us all. Hess also got a side where you can go up and speak to him. Football isn't always flowers and roses. Komen may need Davies' youthful energy on the south coast for a game that has surprisingly been overlooked for domestic TV coverage, so Sky Sports can show a championship game instead or BB Nottingham Forest. New signings Davy Clausen, Wayne Rooney and Jilfie Sigurdsson have failed to shine as number 10s, while Ross Barkley is injured. Davies has featured in all three Premier League games, but only half as a starter, something he seems to accept. The Dutchman has kept standards high on the training pitch according to Davies it's much easier for younger players to come into a team that's doing well, he says. It's hard for everyone when confidence is low, but it's down to the individual to forget about the last game and focus on the next one. At the minute it's tough. People do say we've got too many number 10s, but I think we're all different types of players. Obviously Wayne is so good on the ball and has so much experience, Jilfie adds goals and his set hit plays are so dangerous. It's just finding a way to fit us all in really. It'd say I bring a lot of energy to the team. That's how I like to play, with high energy and getting around the pitch. I'm different to all the other players just like they're different from me. Davies is instantly recognizable with a shock of blonde hair reminiscent of his uncle Alan Whittle who played for Everton and Crystal Palace in the 1970s. The way he runs with socks rolled down to ease pressure on his calves is also a throwback. Davies still lives with his parents and says his life has not changed massively. Coman's side are in desperate need of three points to lift them up the table. His conversation is frequently peppered by a wide, disarming smile, suggesting that the pressure of Everton's current woes isn't adversely getting to him. Having broken through with a goal against Manchester City last season, he still walks round Liverpool with his mates as he always used to. My life has changed massively, but what I do every day hasn't changed that much. I still live with mum and dad, he says. But he admits there has been one perk of receiving a Premier League wage that he has particularly enjoyed. I took my family to Australia last summer. My cousin has been out there for 10 years and the trip was fantastic, just laughing the whole time, being with the family and being out there enjoying ourselves. We did a bit of traveling Perth, Cairns, Sydney. There was also one moment when it became clear playing for Everton is different to most jobs. We were in Ayers Rock, in the middle of absolutely nowhere, waiting to catch a flight to Sydney, and this Aussie guy comes over and says are you Tom Davies? It was a bit strange it just shows you how the Premier League travels.